Hi everybody, today I just want to share a very small haul with you of some things that I've picked up from Superdrug recently. I'll show you the boring things the rest. <laughs> um, Pampers wipes, these are a pound at the moment and you get 56 wipes in here. And I love these, these are actually the sensitive ones. And what I love about them is they've got this plastic flip top there and I like that because I don't like the ones where you have to stick them back over because I just find if you put them in the drawer sometimes that can dry up and then curl up and then your wipes dry up. With these it clips shut and your wipes will never dry up. So I love these. I picked up two of those. I also got um, one of my favourite deodorants from Mitchum. This is the powder fresh one. I love that powdery sort of smell. So I picked up those. So those are the two boring things out the way first. And then I have some makeup to show you and I also have a fragrance. I picked up two of these um, but I gave one to Tony because I didn't really like the smell. I picked up um, Nude by Rihanna and these are just the new sort of fragrance body mists. And they're only £10 and it's 256 mils, so it's really huge. And I love Curious by Brittany. I love the smell, it's gorgeous. And I think the bottle's really, really pretty. I'm so tempted to get a backup in case they stop selling these, which is ridiculous and I've restrained myself. But I do really love this. I love the smell so much and I just find that this lasts ages. Um, I saw a couple of reviews on other sites where people have said, oh, you know, the, the smell doesn't last or linger. I still smell this on my clothes and on my skin at the end of the day. It's so good. And I just think if you are wanting to try a fragrance and you like the smell of it, but you don't want to pay like £20 for a bottle of perfume, you get 256 mils in this, so it's absolutely huge and it'll last you ages. They do have a Nicki Minaj one, which I think is Menagesty. They have a couple of Taylor Swifts, Kim Kardashian, a couple of Rihanna's, and I don't, oh, and I think there's a Paris Hilton. Um, but I just picked up the Curious, and I hope that they do more of these in that range, because I love it. Like I said, £10. Fantastic. Um, the next two things, I got the um, new concealer from, I think it's L'Oreal, yeah, L'Oreal True Match Concealer. I got mine in the lightest colour, I don't know if it's fair, light or pale, I'm sure it's probably fair, um, but it's just one of those twist up sort of pencils. Like I said, it's my skin so you're not really going to see it too much. There it is there. Very, very creamy, doesn't drag on the skin, seems to have quite nice coverage and I, I quite like this sort of turning up pencil sort of idea so I'm quite excited to give that a go and feedback and let you know what I think. And then from L'Oreal also I picked up this lip product because it was buy one get one half price. It is Forgive My Sin 402 and it's a matte. Is that the right way? <laughs> And it's this beautiful red because, you know, I can't resist the red. It seems to take a very long time to dry because I swatched it yesterday. It's got a very strange little wand. Kind of like bent, but it's like angled so that you can be putting it on your lips at an angle rather than like a straight one and you might catch the bottom of your lip. It actually is perfectly angled for the lip. If you can see. But this is lovely, but I did swatch it and it took forever to dry. It was still damp a good 20 minutes later on my hand. But it's so pretty. So I'm going to forgive it. I forgive it, it's sin. Because it's so beautiful. I just love the colour. It reminds me of Russian Red by MAC so much. So that's what that looks like. So incredibly opaque and pigmented. And it's just handy that I've got these wipes here. Because I'm going to wipe that off because I've got some more stuff to swatch. But, yeah, I think it's really pretty and I can't wait to try that one out. And then the other two things I got were buy one get one half price also. I wanted to pick up the new Model Zone eye palette and I've not tried their eye palettes before so I thought I'd give another one a go. Um, this is what they look like, it just says Model Zone Academy. Yeah, smoky eyeshadow palette. These are powder shadows, it comes with one of those little useless applicators that we all throw away. <laughs> and then these are the colours. I find that though, this one and this one are quite samey though this one's more of a matte and that one has a little bit of a satin sheen. I will swatch these for you and I did actually wear these the other day and they are so pretty. Very very pigmented palette, I'm actually really really pleased with it. 
pleasantly surprised if I'm honest. I wasn't too sure what to expect because I always sort of relate models on to nail polish rather than makeup but those are the swatches for that and as you can see really lovely and that's them this way. So you've got a really nice shimmery white, a shimmery sort of warm taupe colour, then you've got a matte black, a shimmery silver, a gun matte -o, which has a little bit of a shimmer to it and then a sort of satin sort of black. Really lovely, really super pigmented and like I said I wore this the other day and the colours are just gorgeous. So I'm really really pleased with that. And the great thing about this I thought was I don't like to take expensive makeup out and about with me but if I've got a lot of meetings and events to go to and I might want to just check up on my makeup like kind of midway through the day, make sure it's still looking really good and fresh. So I would take this and I would take a little, you know, my little Sephora brush set which is the one that kind of they all link together which is great and I'd take this and then I'd be able to top up any sort of colours. So I thought that was really useful for that. And then the one that I really wanted which is covered in smudges and fingerprints, let me just give that a quick rub off. This one is called the Chrome Cream Eyeshadow Palette. <gasps> Look at it. It's rose gold and coppery coloured and so pretty. I love it. Again it comes with this, it comes with kind of a foamy sil silicone sort of ends on it rather than a brush end because the other one came with a silicone sort of end and then a little brush. But the best thing to use with cream shadows is these kind of foamy sort of applicators and I have actually used it with that. And then I have had a little bit of a play so these are not <laughs> pristine but that's what these colours look like in this palette. And I will swatch these. So that's what the swatches look like for this one. You've got a white silver followed by a true silver, then a strong gunmetal, a very yellow gold which you know I don't like those so I'm not too sure about that one, a copper colour and then a bronzy brown colour. And that's those. So I'm really really pleased with them. I like cream products so I'm quite excited to use these. Apart from that yellow colour I think this is a really pretty palette so really excited about that. And that's it for my very small super drug haul. Hope you've enjoyed this video as always guys. Don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. I'm going to love and leave you and see you all soon. See you the next time. Bye.